I'm going to teach you how you can add your basic commission splits to a sale that you've made. Firstly, in the life cycle, sales advice area, you want to make sure that you have all of your sales dates filled in. The agent who sold the property will enter in your contract price and the commission amount or percent that you have charged. Once this has all been entered, you can then scroll to the bottom and update the sales advice for this to save. The next step is you're now ready to add your commission splits, so you can go to the Commissions tab. When adding commission splits, it's important to note that there has to be 100% allocation completed. To do this, we go into the Manage Commission Splits, and the first thing it will ask you to do is to set a price, a percent, and then a sign. We're going to use percent as the basic way to start the split, and we want to split this percentage of the commission 100% and hit tick. The next thing that we can do now that we have selected 100% of the commission is if we need to divide that between two or three people, we then hit the plus icon to give us a branch off that first 100% split and we can choose to split either a price of that 100% or a percent. Now to keep this easy, let's do a 20-20-60 split. We'll go into the percent and we're going to do 20 and assign that to a user in the office, which is myself, for a list. As we want to keep adding to the top level 100%, we're going to hit the top plus icon to put the next branch on this 100% split. In that percent, we're now going to do another 20 for the selling agent. We're going to hit assign, and we're going to assign that to Andrew, and that is going to be the sell. Now for the remainder 60% that we need to allocate, we're going to hit the plus, so we can see it's part of this 100%. We now need to set the final percentage of 60. And we're going to assign that to the office. And they're going to get the management. And then we can hit the tick option. So now that we have 100% allocated of this split, we can hit the update splits option. And we can see that now displayed on the screen. Remember, 100% must be allocated for the splits to show on the screen.